Well, good Tuesday evening, afternoon. I hope you're having a great day. After a very breezy, blustery day yesterday, things have calmed down for most of our area, but we are still tracking some breezy winds this afternoon and evening. We're looking at some chilly overnight lows. Some areas getting down below that freezing level tonight, so a little bit chilly outside. We do have a gradual warming trend that's going to start. Uh, you'll start to feel that tomorrow evening into Thursday. Sunny days ahead as we get ready for the next weekend. Now we do have a wind advisory through 11 o'clock tonight in the Kittitas Valley. Once again, 30 to 40 mile an hour winds with gusts up to 50 miles an hour. In fact, if you're wondering just how much wind and who where was the windiest yesterday, it was Ellensburg where we recorded some wind speeds of 65 miles an hour. Look at Hermiston, pretty impressive, close to 50 miles an hour there, and we were windy all through the area. But the good news is those winds are decreasing and moving on out of the area tonight. So look for partly cloudy skies, chilly temperatures, winds diminishing with temperatures all through the area in the 30s. And as you can see, a few of our locations getting down to that freeze point at 32 degrees, including Yakima, Ellensburg, Pendleton and Dayton tonight. We should just stay above that tonight in the Tri Cities. Uh, this is uh, for tomorrow. Planning your day out the door again, a little on the cool side. We're going to have mostly sunny skies with a few lingering clouds, but a really nice day overall. Winds won't be a problem tomorrow. We'll see temperatures getting in the 50s by noon lunchtime and then at dinner time will be anywhere from the 50s here into the mid 60s. So a gradual warming trend two to three degrees more tomorrow. And then as we head towards the weekend, we'll get those temperatures above average. So lots to talk about tonight. We'll catch you on the air at five, six and 11.